The people involved in football are in a state of mourning. According to the Okaloosa County Sheriff's Office, the former National Football League quarterback Ryan Mallett passed away on June 27 in what appears to have been a drowning incident off a Florida beach. He was 35. According to a press release from the agency, emergency personnel were dispatched to a beach in Destin at approximately 2.12 p.m. local time after receiving reports that a group of individuals were attempting to return to shore from a nearby sandbar but were having difficulty doing so. It was eventually determined that Mallet was the one who went under the water and was unable to breathe when the lifeguards brought him out. Attempts to save Mallet's life were made before he was rushed to a local hospital, where it was determined that he was no longer alive. It has not been determined what caused the death officially. Mallet broke out into the national football scene for the first time in 2007, when he was still a player for the University of Michigan. He made the move to the University of Arkansas the next year, but due to NCAA regulations, he was not allowed to begin playing for his new school until 2009. Before being drafted into the National Football League in 2011, he started at quarterback for the Arizona Razorbacks for two seasons. Mallet began his career as a professional athlete with the New England Patriots, where he spent the first three years of his career as backup quarterback behind Tom Brady. After that, he was moved to the Houston Texans and played for them for the next two seasons. In 2015, he signed a contract with the Baltimore Ravens. After another year had passed, he participated in the team's last game. After learning of Mallet's loss, a number of notable figures from the NFL turned to social media to express their condolences and grief over his passing. Bill Belichick, who has been the head coach of the Patriots for a very long time, issued a statement in which he said, I am extremely saddened by Ryan's tragic passing. My thoughts and prayers are with his family, as well as the many individuals whose lives he impacted. May he rest in peace. In the meantime, his former teammate with the Texans, J.J. Watt, posted on Twitter, Horrible news to read about Ryan Mallett. Gone way too soon. May you rest in peace brother. John Harbaugh, the head coach of the Ravens, extended his condolences as well, adding in a statement, Ryan was a part of us. I will never forget the love that he had for his teammates, as well as the fact that he made the most of and enjoyed each and every football day while he was here. Mallett was serving as the head coach of the football team at Whitehall High School in Arkansas at the time of his passing. It is with great sadness that we share the loss of Coach Ryan Mallett, the school said in a statement that was posted to Facebook. Coach Mallett was a respected teacher and coach who was adored by many. We ask that you pray for his family as well as his team, students, and colleagues coaches at Whitehall School District. Thanks for watching.